Hey everybody, it's Jason Shadrick with Premier Guitar, and we're at the Fender booth with Brian and Billy to talk about your latest acoustic electric thing you guys have created here. So tell us a little about what you have. Yeah, so what we started with uh, three years ago, Brian and I sought out to how could we innovate the acoustic guitar market. Um, and what's what you're seeing here is the culmination of those three years and a ton of great um, engineering folks in their internal building. So what you see here is the first ever acoustic guitar from Corona, California, so US made. It is a mahogany spread, forearm contour. We've, we've actually hollowed out the inside of the guitar. We've added a sound port, so not a typical sound hole on acoustics, but an actual port to help project the sound. A mahogany Telecaster neck, um, and that's the basic structure of the outside of the guitar. It needed to work first and foremost as an acoustic, so I'll let Brian kind of strum some chords here so you can hear. So that shows you the guitar is actually doing something from an acoustic standpoint first and foremost. What we're going to do is walk you through the difference in the control. So you have a piezo pickup, you have a modified noiseless 4 Fender electric pickup, and then under the underside in between those two under the top is a um, body sensing pickup. And we'll talk you through when we get to that because it helps with percussive and harmonics and some other things, some unique things there. So we're going to start in position 5 on the A side. So volume knob, this is a mod knob or modification knob which allows you to move between the two distinct uh, voices that are on each end of the A and B side and then a five-way switch and in each position you'll have two different unique sounds with blending and movability in between each of those sounds. So Brian's going to kick off with a rosewood back inside spruce top full-blown dreadnought. So again, that's position five on the A side. As we roll into the B side, I'll let Brian strum and I'll roll it. We're gonna go to a Rosewood back inside spruce top auditorium. So tighten up the waist, bring out the mids a little more. You can hear the two distinct voices at the end of each of those. This is not, um, you know, we, we allowed the user to be able to put in as little or as much. So there's not a specified number, it's a continuous knob okay. and allows you to, if you want more of the mids in your dreadnought, you go one way. If you want more of the bass in your auditorium, you can come back the other way as little or as much as you want mm -hmm. to find the tone you're looking for. Position five on the A and B side. Yep. What we're gonna do is move to position four. This is gonna start off what we'll call alternative acoustic sound. So a maple back and side, parlor so super bright tight finger picking great for this we'll start there when we sweep we're going to actually go to a mahogany back inside spruce top dreadnought so you'll get to hear the variance between what a what a maple parlor does all the way through to a full body mahogany dreadnought And now to the Mahogany Dreadnought. So in position five and four, those are the voices there. Think of those as shape shifting, yep. moving between shapes. What we start to incorporate into position three now is we'll go position three on the A side. This is going to start out as a Brazilian Rosewood Dreadnought. What we're going to do now is you're not going to shift to a different body shape. You're going to actually engage the body sensing pickup that's under the top. And what that does is allow for, and Brian can showcase, but tapping percussive players harmonics, when it's, in, when it's not engaged, you don't hear as much of it. Obviously, nothing going on. When you engage it, you actually start to get the full sound of a, what a percussive player would look like. So we'll start with the Brazilian Dreadnought to start. The beauty of that one too is that you get the chance Go ahead, Brian, I'll let you jump in on that one. Yeah. 
So even if you're not a percussive or a harmonic player, you could hear just in Brian's strumming that that body sensing pickup bolsters that sound of the Brazilian rosewood. So as we go back into position A, we're gonna to move to two. This is now where we're gonna engage and start out as a more of the Americana sound of a mahogany dreadnought mic'd up. So the difference of not being plugged in, but the distance in the microphone. As we go into here, we're, this will be the first time we engage the magnetic pickup. Okay. It's not gonna to shift to only the magnetic pickup. It's gonna bring the magnetic pickup so that the yeah, acoustic blended. and electric can run parallel. Okay. Yep. Okay. And this is when it gets fun. We're known for our Fender electric tone. Because we already have the magnetic pickup, we decided to go with a clean Fender tone. When we roll this through, it's actually just gonna fatten it up or boost it. Okay. available and what will be the price points on them? So the price point is $19.99 US retail. They're actually available and they started selling as of 10 a.m. this morning. 10 a.m. this morning? You guys Select sold out yet? And online, there already are reports of a few <laughs> dealers that are already sold out, yes. All right, cool. Well, where can people go online to find out information about the Acoustasonic and everything else you guys are doing at Fender? Yeah, if you visit Fender.com, all the information's there. It can walk you through and talk you through and even show you dealers in your area that might have stock on hand and readily available to purchase. All right. Well, Brian, we're going to have you play us out. Thanks a lot, guys. This is Jason Shadrick with Premier Guitar.